good afternoon all we are discussing the chapter money and we discuss money comes in the form of notes and coins and early coins were made of bronze and silver each country has its own money what we will call each country has its own money we call it as currency very good daksha lakshmi currency and what is indian currency indian currency rupee. is rupee. rupee indian currency rupee. is rupee very good aradhya very good indian currency is rupee and today we are revising today we are going to discussing discuss the rate and rate or price a rate or price i ma'am is going to share the screen no need to take any textbook or notebook listen to ma'am look at the screen okay listen to ma'am look at the screen no need to take any book now let me share the screen you can see a picture and here it is written the item and its price you can see a pair of socks a pair of socks and near to that socks you can see a price tag you can see a price tag krishna raj what is the price of this socks what is the price of this socks ah rupees 20 rupees 20 it's only written here so you can see another one a frock you can see a frock dear kp what is the value or what is the price of this frock 18 ah rupees 80 Rupees eight. Now another one, a pair of slippers. Devadarsh, what is the value or what is the price of the slippers? Fifty rupees. Ah, rupees. Fifty rupees. Fifty rupees. Very good. Very good. Ten rupees. rupees. Now, a friend, what about the big coloring book? What is the value or what is the price of this book? Rupees hundred. Hundred rupees one hundred. So what do you understood from this? I saw many. Huh? So what? What do you understood from this? Rate or price? What is that? A rate or price? The value of goods. Goods means here we can say things. The value of goods. We call it as their price or uh, rate. Okay. See when we go to the shop. Uh, for buying the frock or shirt, uh, we can see along with the shirt or frock the price tag. Is or no? Yes. So that price tag will tell us its price or its rate. So price or rate means the value of the goods. It is called their price or rate. Okay, it's understood. Price or rate. Is it clear? Price or rate. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay. Now let me share the screen once again. Okay. Now we discuss that money comes in the form of notes and coins. How we can write the money? How we can write money? Money is written in rupees and paisa. Okay. Money is written in rupees and paisa. Sometimes you may be seen that if you go and uh, um, buy any sharpener or scale or razor, you may be seen that it is written two rupees fifty paisa or three rupees twenty five paisa. So it's written like this. Maybe the symbol of rupees. Then like this. How we will read this? How we will read this? We can read this. Four rupees, paisa. Paisa. Four rupees, paisa. Four rupees, fifty, paisa. Paisa. Ah, uh, here you can see the money is written in rupees and paisa. Money is written in rupees and paisa. You can also see the rupees and paisa are separated by a small thing that we will call it as dot. Rupees and paisa are separated by dot. Dot. Okay. So before the dot, we can see the rupees. After the dot, we can see the paisa. Paisa. Okay. Now uh, let me write another one. How we can write 
how we will read this how we will read this how ten, many rupees how ten, many ten, ten rupees, rupees. Ten. Ah. very good very good Ten rupees twenty-five paisa. Very good. Ten rupees twenty-five paisa. Here also we can see money is written in rupees and paisa, and the paisa and rupees separated by a dot. Separated by a dot. dot. So money comes in the form of coins and notes, and money is written in rupees and paisa, separated by a dot. Okay, is it clear to you all? Is it clear to you all how we are writing money? Money is written in rupees and paisa, separated by a dot. Okay. So first of all, we discuss a rate or price. Rate or price is the value of the goods that we call its rate or price. And money written in rupees and paisa, separated by a dot. Okay. This much is clear. Yes. yes. This is clear. Yes. Yes. Now let me share again. And <clears throat> okay. Now you may be seen that nowadays we are using coins. In that coins you saw paisa. Which paisa you saw? Which paisa? One paisa you can see, you know, nowadays we are Fine. using. Yes, ah. one. Which paisa? What is the value of the paisa we are using nowadays? Is it 5 or 10 or 25 or 20? One. One. 50. Which one. paisa? One. Nowadays? Fifty. Can... Fifty paisa coin. Okay? Fifty paisa coin. Fifty paisa coin. So, I have two fifty paisa coins in my hand. Okay? Now I have two fifty paisa oh, wow. coins in my can, in my hand. For paisa, we put the yeah, symbol P. So two fifty paisa coins. I, I want to know or I want to find how many total, how much money in my hand as total. So if one, I, total, two, ah, one, if, if I want to find the total, what I should do? Total is related to what? Total one, is related to addition. One. So we have to add the numbers. Then I will get the total 50. amount of uh, 50 plus 50. Very good. Now let us add 50 plus 50. 50 plus 50. Now at one place we have 0 plus 0. What is answer 0 plus 0 or Adhya? 0. Uh, 0 plus 0 is equal to 0. At tenth place we have 5 plus 5. What is answer 5 plus 5? 10. Ten. Five. Ten. Five. Ten. Five. 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 100 paisa. 100 paisa. paisa plus 50 paisa is equal to 100 paisa. 100 paisa means 100 paisa means it is rupee 1. 100 paisa means it is rupee 1. 250 two paisa coins will make 100 paisa. That 100 paisa means it is rupee 1. Or we can see 250 paisa coins means it is 1 rupee. Rupee 1. Understood? Rupee 1. one. So, what are the things we discussed today? What are the things we discussed today? First of all, rate or price. Rate or price. Rate or price. price. We call it as its rate or price. And next one, money comes in the form of notes and coins. Money is written in rupees and paisa. And this rupees and paisa are separated by a Separated by a dot. Separated by a dot. Okay. Separated by a dot. A dot. Two fifty paisa coins together will make hundred paisa. Then this hundred paisa means it is rupee one. one. Okay. This much is clear to you today. Yes. Write yes. these points in the notebook. Yes, ma'am. 
please take a notebook and pencil please take a notebook and pencil now as points we can write today's class and we have the first point today yes ready are you ready with the notebook and pencil shall we start yes ma'am okay now let us write 50 paisa plus 50 paisa this means these are coins okay these are coins 50 paisa plus 50 paisa right. yeah yeah yes please write please write 50 paisa plus 50 paisa 50 paisa plus 50 paisa what is the total paisa 100 100 so we can write 100 paisa 50 paisa plus 50 paisa is equal to 100 paisa now another point that means 100 paisa is equal to what 100 paisa is equal to dash 1 ah 1 rupee 100 paisa means 1 rupee 100 paisa is equal to rupee 1 rupee 1 rupee very good 100 paisa means it is rupee 1 so two 50 paisa coins will make 100 paisa and 100 paisa means it is rupee 1 so we can say 250 paisa is equal to rupee 1 okay Two. All of you have completed two points. Let us write the next one. Yes. 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 Okay. Now we can write what is rate or price. T H E the T H E and T H E the T H E the T H E the B A L U E value B A L U E value A L U A L value E value O F of O F of of T H E the T H E the the value of the goods G O O D S goods E L O O the value The goods. goods. The value of the goods. The value of the goods. H I S is is the the value of the goods is the value of the goods is is. C A E L O D C A L L is called is called O is called A L L E D H E I R there there. The value of the goods called the E I E I R there R A T E rate rate R A T E or O O or T Rate or price? Or 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 price? P 
price price p r i c e price p r i e p r i c e price price p r the value of the price The value, the value of the goods or their rate or the price. And the value, the value of the goods, their rate or their rate or present. Okay. Now we can write the next point. M O N E Y. M O N E Y. Money. Money. M M O N E Y. M W R I T T E N. W R I T T E N. Money is written. Money is written. W R I T T E N. Written. T T E N. Written. I N in. And in I money is written in money is written dash and dash. Can you complete it? Dash, dash and dash. A N D. Dash and dash. 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 Dash P I S A P A I S E P I S A R U P R U P I S R U P I S A P A I S A P A I S E P I S A Money is written in rupees and paisa P A I S E paisa P A I S E. Money is written in rupees and paisa, comma. S E P E R A T E D. Separated. S S E P E R A T E D separated. A E E D separated. Separated. B Y. B Y. Money is written by piece and piece. Money is written by rupees and piece. S E P E R A T E D separated B Y by separated by a dash. Can you complete it? Separated, separated by, by a dot. Very good. Separated by a dot. Separated by a dot. Money is written in rupees and paisa. Separated by a dot. D O T dot. Money is written in rupees and paisa, separated by a dot. Palm reader complete. Okay. Money is written in rupees and paisa, separated by a dot. Aradhya completed. Please write, write. Money is written in rupees and paisa, separated by a dot. 
we have one more point Money by. is written in rupees and paisa separated by a dot. Why a dot? And we have the last point. Put the symbol of rupees four dot five zero. How we will read this? How we will read this? Four rupees. Very good. Four rupees. Fifty paisa. Fifty paisa. Very good. Paisa. Is I S is red as red R E A D red. As R E D red R E A D R E A D red as R E A D red as ten T R E A D red A S as red as E D D. The hat. F I O U R four. F O U R four. The F four. F O O U R. Write the last point, Aradhya. Put the symbol of rupee. Then write four dot five zero. Is red as four rupees. F I F T Y fifty. Yes. P R A I S E paisa. Four rupees fifty paisa. Four rupees. Is is four rupees fifty paisa. Ten has has as four. Ma'am, I completed. Very good. If you have completed, you can close uh -huh. your notebook and listen. Yes, I finished. Devadash. Devadash, you close your notebook and listen to me. I closed it. Ma'am, thank you so much. Four rupees, fifty paisa. Fifty paisa. Or. Uh, P E S Rupees Rupees Can be the complete. Okay, good. E F 
Paisa. P-A-I-S-E. Paisa. Paisa. Mom, I finished. It's okay. So, 4 rupees, 50 paisa. Okay? Now, let me stop sharing. Yes, yes ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay, okay. Do you want to see the board again? No, ma'am. No, no ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay, Aradhya. I will share once again. Please write first. I S E. Finish. Okay. So, next we are going to discuss. Only we are discussing today. We have only less time. So, just we can discuss how we will add the small amounts of money. How we will add the value of, of the money. Okay. Now, let me share the screen. You can close your notebook and listen to me. No need to write again. See that we will write in the next class. Okay. Let me share the screen once again. And listen here. Ma'am, we can close the notebook. Yeah, yes, yes. Please close your notebook. Listen to ma'am. Look at the screen. See, I have a coin of, uh, I have not a, two coins of 50 paisa. Right. No need to write. Listen here. 50 okay. paisa. Okay, two coins are there. So, what is the total paisa in my hand? What is the total paisa in my hand? Hundred. Very good. Very good. I have hundred paisa. Hundred paisa is also equal to how much rupee? One rupee. 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 No, no. Please listen to ma'am. No need to write now. This we will write in the next class. Okay. Just we are discussing today and we will write in the next class. Now listen here. See, I have another coins. Two coins of one rupee. Two coins of one rupee. Can you tell me how much, what is the total of amount in my hands? Two. Ah, two. How you go to the number two? We add the number which is one. One and one. one. Here one. Is one. Number one. Here also we have number one. So one plus one. What is one plus one? one? Two. two. So what is the total amount in my hands? Rupee. Two. 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 Rupee. Two. 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 No need to write now. We we'll listen here. Now another one. I have a coin of rupees one. Another coin of rupees two. What is the total amount in my hand? Three. Ah, oh, very good. One plus three. This one and this two. One plus three. That is equal to rupees three. 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 Very three. good. Rupees three. Now another one. I have a coin of rupees five. Another coin of one. Another coin of rupees one. Rupee one. What is the total in my hands? Six. Ah, five plus one. Five plus one. Six. What is the answer? Six. 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 What is the total amount in my hand? Six. 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 Rupees six. I have a total amount of rupees six. Now. Now, this is much about coins. Now, let us see some knots. Let us talk about some knots. Some notes. Okay. No need to write now. Listen here. I have a knot of 10 rupee knot I have and one 20 rupee knot I have. Okay. So, what is the total amount in my hands? Add the number. That means it's 10 plus 20. 10 plus 20. 20. Now let us add. At one piece, we have 0 plus 0. plus 0 is equal to? No need to write. 0 is equal to 0. Ah, yes. No need to write, my dear. 1 plus 2. What is the answer? 1 plus 2? 3. 3. So what is the total amount in my hand? What is the total amount in my hand? 
Thirty. Thirty. Very good. I have a thirty. Another one. I have two notes of rupees twenty. Okay. One more note I have that is also rupees twenty itself. So what is the total amount in my hands? What is the total amount in my hand? Just add the number. D plus twenty. D plus twenty. Zero plus zero equal to zero. Zero forty. Equal to four. Rupees forty. Forty. It is rupees four. Okay. So it. So this we we will write in the next class in the notebook. Okay. So that is the last topic in that chapter. After that we can take the workbook. Okay. So we will meet in the next class. Bye bye. See you in the next class. Bye, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Bye, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Bye.